Hi guys, it's Tom here. I'm here for another live workout. So if you haven't done any of the ones that we did before, the first one we did was a fitness test. The second one we did was a yoga inspired workout. So I'm hoping that um, uh, you're going to enjoy this workout. It's going to be a HIIT workout, which means high intensity interval training. It's gonna be 20 minutes and we're gonna do every minute on the minute. And the first minute that we're gonna do is 40 star jumps with five burpees. And now if you struggle to do burpees and you're a beginner at working out and you just wanna get into it, don't worry about doing the burpees. But when I say 40 star jumps, I mean doing one, two, three, four, not like one, two. Because what we're gonna do is at the start of every single minute, we are going to um, have you guys do the, that amount of reps, and once you've done that amount of reps, you're then gonna move on to uh, a little bit of rest, and then when the next minute starts, you're gonna do 10 squats, and for the squats, we're just gonna do very, very basic, just sit back on your heels, and feel like you're pulling the ground apart as well, because that's always gonna get your glutes a little bit more. So you're sitting back into your heels, and pushing up through like that, you're gonna do 10 of them, then you're gonna do 10 crunches, and I think everybody knows what a crunch is. What you're gonna do is you're gonna be on your back, and you're gonna keep your core engaged and your chest rounded, and you're gonna bring, sit yourself up like this. So like kind of half a sit up, not all the way up, but kind of halfway up, and just to feel the crunch in your core. And then the last thing that you're gonna do are 10 press ups. I think everyone knows what press ups are too, but you're gonna start like this, and you're gonna go from press up position, plank position all the way down, then all the way back up. Trying to keep a flat, as flat a line as possible when you're doing it. Okay, so, who is ready to start? Because it's going to be a fun one. And in between the rest parts, I'm going to try and answer as many of your questions as I possibly can. So, what we're gonna do is get myself two seconds, know what am I gonna do. Okay, so, right, we're gonna get this going right now. So give me a second to get the timer going. And once the timer is going, um, we are gonna start the workout. So if you have any questions for me and you're a little bit worrying about what you're gonna be doing and how you're gonna to manage to keep up with the workout, then please just send me all the questions that you have because I'm gonna try and answer as many as I can as I'm going. So what we're gonna do is we are gonna start in three, two, one, with 20 of these. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 25, 26, all the way up to 40, 30, 1, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Now for the burpees. If you can do the burpees, great. If not, don't worry. If you're a beginner at working out, because we're going to start from doing what you can do, not worrying about what other people can do, go to your own fitness level. See now, I finished that in about 30 seconds, 40 seconds. So when we get to the next minute, we're gonna start doing the 10 squats, 10 crunches, and 10 press ups. So that is going to be, as the faster you do these, the more rest you have in between it. So now we're going in three seconds, two, one, four, 10 squats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then into ten crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then into plank position for ten press ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now rest. And we're gonna be resting again now until the start of the next minute. So we have 20 seconds. So I'm gonna answer a couple of your questions. Um, who has a question for me in the next one? Okay, someone's asked me if I've ever Googled myself. Yeah, sometimes that does happen, but I always find that they have the cringiest photos ever come up. So we're gonna start again, back to what we did the first time. We're 40 sergeants, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten all the way up to 40. Just try and keep pushing through as hard as you can. The more you put in, the more you're gonna get out. 10 more. 
it. Five, four, three, two, one. And then into burpees. We're going to do five burpees. And if you don't need, can't do the burpees, you can try and keep up. But if you don't manage the burpees, don't worry about it. The next time you do it, you're going to feel strong, you're going to get better, and you can really keep a mark on your progress. So now we're going to rest again. And we're going to rest for another 20 seconds because I finished the workout of that little section of that minute. So I've got 20 seconds to answer some of your questions. So, uh, what do we eat after this workout? That's actually a good question because next week I'm gonna have a video all about one of my favorite post-workout treats. So make sure you stay tuned for that one. But now it's time to squat. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we're gonna do this for 20 minutes. So alternating minutes, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Into your press ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this is where the intervals come into play because you're going to do lots of intense exercise and then you're going to stop and rest completely. But in my resting, I'm going to be answering some of your questions. So I'm going to have another question for you to answer. Um, so I was asking what my favourite food is, and my favourite food is actually ice cream, and I've got a really healthy alternative, like I mentioned about my next video, because um, there's one thing that I can't live without, and that's ice cream, but there is a healthier alternative, and very easy to make as well, so make sure you stay tuned for that one. Okay, and now we're back into star jumps, one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, Thirty-one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now we're going right back into the burpees, if you can. Even if you just manage to do a couple each time, try and push yourself. And rest. Now you don't, look, the faster you get it done, the more time you have to rest in between sets. So I've got time to answer another question of yours. So. So we've got first question that comes up. Oh my God, there's so many. Um, um, how often do I work out? I actually tend to work out five hours a day, six days a week, but that's just because of my diving training and that's the amount that I have to do to be an Olympian. But we're back into squatting now. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, now down, and we're gonna do crunches. 10 of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Press ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. And the good thing about this workout is that it hits so many different parts of your body all at once. And I do actually have a short and abbreviated version on my channel already of this workout. And it's quite useful if you need to, a little bit of a recap of what you're doing. So, um, well, next question. Someone's asked, do I ever eat chocolate? And the answer is yes, because every now and then you have to make sure that you treat yourself because else you can go a little bit insane if you're trying to be healthy all the time and all you want to do is cheat. So, right, next thing we do, we're back to the star jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. The faster you can do these, the more rest you're going to have. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And into the burpees. Again, if you are struggling with the burpees, do not worry. You can do as many as you can. Aim for five, but if you only get one in, it's better than none. And rest again. And it's quite hard to talk at the same time as doing this workout, but now I'm going to answer some more of your questions. Um, Someone's asked, where's Lance? And Lance is actually downstairs, so we've got some friends coming over a little bit later. So he's downstairs tidying things up. Um, but yeah, I'm, as you can see, getting a little bit sweaty now. Hair is a little bit of a mess, but we're gonna deal with it, because when we're working out, who cares? That's not the point of looking good when you're working out, right? You've gotta try and stay active and healthy. So now we'll go back into the squat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, now sit-ups. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and now into press ups. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whew. It's feeling good. You can definitely feel the burn when you're doing this one. Okay, so now the next thing that we're going to be doing is back to the star jumps and stuff, but I'm now going to answer a couple more questions. So, someone, uh, someone's asked if I'm ever going to come back to Brazil. I hope to come back to Brazil because I absolutely loved it in Brazil. It was one of the most amazing experiences. So, and it's such a cool country. Right, okay, now we're going to get back into the star jumps. The minute starts now. So, one, two, three, four. All the way up to 40. Keep pushing yourself. I know it's probably going to be tough by now, but this is something that you can build up to. You can start with 20 of these, then go to 30, then go to 40. But do what you can do right now. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and into the burpees. Push yourself. If you haven't done any burpees so far, just try and do one. Even if it's not extending out all the way, do half a burpee. Just give it your best shot. Okay, now rest again. Time for more questions. Right, what have we got here? Um, someone, someone's asked if I'm looking forward to the Olympics in 2020, 24 and 28. I think there's some great candidate cities. I think Paris and LA are gonna do a great job. And I think Tokyo is gonna be pretty awesome too. But now we're going into squats, so right back to it. 10 of them, 10 of each of these exercises. And they keep pushing. When it gets tough and you feel like you want to stop, keep going. <laughs> You'll thank yourself after because it will help you feel so much better, get the blood flowing. And it's only going to take 20 minutes of exercise to do everything that you're going to need for a day. Nine. 10 and rest. Again, I'm gonna to get to more of your questions right now. So, we've got, what's the first question we're gonna ask, answer? Uh, let's see, wow, there's lots of um, questions. Someone's asked if you ever come to Germany, and actually, Germany is one of my favorite places in terms of, I loved Berlin when I went in 2014. Me and Lance say that it was one of the places that we could see ourselves living, so. We love it there. Okay, now we're going back to star jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen. 14. By the way, we're halfway now, or over halfway, because now we started this one. So keep pushing. You can do it, because you've done it this far. You've just got to go through the motions. And make sure that you're focusing on your form to get through the whole workout. Okay, so now that's 40. Now we're going to the burpees. Again, try and push yourself to do some of these burpees because if you haven't done any previously, just try and push yourself to do just one. And if you manage to do just one, that's excellent because you probably thought that you wouldn't be able to. So I know that you will be able to. Okay. Uh, someone's asked, how do you lose weight? And that's a difficult question because lots of it comes down to nutrition. Um, but doing little hit workouts like this could be a massive help too. So now we're going back to squats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Roll over to do your press ups. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and rest. It's quite an easy workout to remember because once you've done it one round, it's going to be the same the whole way through. So, as you can see, I'm sweating. It's normal, so don't worry about it. Um, it'll be good if you can get a little bit of sweat on, especially because it's really hot in here. Um, someone's asked about gaining weight because they struggle to put on weight. And that's a really good question. It's all down to nutrition again. By upping your carbs, it might help you actually gain a little bit more weight. So, now we're going back to start jumps. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 19, 20. Keep pushing. So, hit to nine, 30, 1, 32, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. 
So now we're going to the burpees. I know I keep saying it, but if you haven't tried any burpees yet, give it a go. Even if you last time you did one, try and do two this time. And give it your best shot. Because there's a sense of satisfaction from actually managing to do what you thought you'd never be able to do. So keep pushing yourself. Okay, so now we're going down to, so it's as if I'm gonna take a shower now. And no, because I'm halfway through the workout. So unfortunately that will not be part of the video. Um, <laughs> so the next thing that we're gonna do is go right back into the squat. So this is really where you need to focus on sitting back in your heels for the squat to really activate your glutes. Okay, so now one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, down for sit-ups, or crunch it. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, roll over onto your stomach and face down, do press-ups, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and rest. Okay, now, Back to you guys and the questions. What do you have for me? Uh, okay, oh look, there's so many questions coming in. Uh, someone asked me about my GB sofa. It's actually my favorite thing is the Union Jack. So whenever I have anything that is possibly looks or resembles that, I've even got Union Jack curtains. So I know it's a little bit weird, but it's fine, right? Okay, so now, what my, uh, so now we're back to, the star jumps, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 38, 39, 40. Now we're down to the burpees. 1, 2, 3, 4. Push yourself to get them done. Okay, so now we are going to be back to questions. Look how sweaty I am right now. That is disgusting, but I guess it's all part of it. Um, someone's asked what my body fat ratio, and that really does depend on what time of the season I am, because right now I'm on my time off, so I don't start training until September 4th, so I think I might be around 9 or 10%, but who's counting? <laughs> 10 squats, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now on the floor, 10 crunches. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now onto your stomach. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. For you guys that are able to keep up with this, you're doing a good job. So it's a really good way to improve your fitness doing cardio training like this. Okay, so now we are going to more questions. Uh, someone's asked if I'm actually gonna be going to the um, Olympics in 2020. That's a good question because currently nobody's qualified to go. So it's gonna be a challenge to qualify in 2019. And that's my goal. I'm gonna keep striving towards that. So fingers crossed. I will get there. Now I'm going to do star jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to stop counting because it's probably getting on all your nerves. 15, 20, 30, 8, 9, 10. Now into your burpees. For those of you who haven't done any burpees yet, just give one a go. And if you can keep up with the full five, again, like I said before, you're doing well and you're gonna thank yourself afterwards because having that challenge that you're setting yourself and being able to achieve it and setting yourself goals is really, really important. So, someone's asked if I'm gonna do um, a fitness challenge with Lance one day and you might have to just actually bombard Lance with that because I am so up for it, but you'd have to ask Lance. He's pretty fit himself, so he probably showed me up. Okay, now squat. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Into crunches. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now we're rolling over onto our stomach for press ups. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! Getting hot now, especially because it's hot. For, for once, the weather is actually really good here in London. We've got nice and sunny. Although every time we do this live workout thing, it's always so hot. Okay, so, um, what? someone's asked me if I've always been sporty, and the answer is not really. I used to hate doing at school, but now I, like, I don't find myself naturally sporty, but I do enjoy diving. So now we're back to star jumps. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Keep pushing yourself. If you find it easier to pace yourself and go slightly slower, do that. But bear in mind, the faster you do it, the longer that you are going to have to rest in between minutes. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And again, if you haven't done any burpees yet, give one a go. And if you've only managed to do one, remember that. And the next time you try this workout, try and make it so that you do two. And gradually build yourself back up. Okay, so now, we've got one more question in between minutes. What is the good age to start diving? And that's a good question because it all really depends. But as soon as you're a strong enough swimmer to be able to be competent in the water, then you are good to go. And guys, guess what? This is the last thing you're gonna be doing. So 10 squats, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. And down to the floor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Roll over onto your stomach. Ten press ups. Keep pushing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! Good job, guys. We are done. That was a 20 minute HIT workout. HIT meaning high intensity interval training to get the heart rate up and then get yourself to recover. We did every minute on the minute, a set of exercises on the even minutes and a set of minutes, set of exercises on the odd minutes. So I hope you enjoyed it. Now the key is to recover. Make sure that you're drinking lots of water because making sure that you fuel properly is key. The thing that I have post recovery is either normally protein shakes. You can get it naturally through, um, I don't know, boiled eggs, chicken, Greek yogurt, but for me, having something delicious and something to look forward to after a workout is something that makes it worth working out. So next week I've got a video of one of my favorite things that I eat after a workout, and it is some form of protein ice cream. And you only need two ingredients, so, or three, but it's, uh, I'm really excited for you guys to see it actually because it's gonna be really fun. But for now, I'm gonna answer a couple of your questions before I go and do my recovery. Um, thank you for those who are watching where it's like 2 a.m. in the morning. Um, but if you aren't watching it live, um, thank you for coming back and doing the workout another time because the beauty of the live workout is that it's gonna be um, on my channel afterwards so you can come back and do the workout again, give it another shot, keep pushing yourself and keep trying to do better and better every single time that you do it. Um, but thank you so much for, for coming and I'll do a, someone's ask when we upload a honeymoon video. I mean, I did film it, but I think that one's gonna be for us. Although there might be some parts that are quite funny to share, so maybe I'll share a little bit of that. Um, um, someone's asked about meditation and it's something that I do every single morning for 10 minutes, just a bit more mindfulness than anything, just focusing on breathing and trying to center myself. I think it really, really does help set you up for the day, relieves lots of stress and helps you deal with certain situations that are a little bit more stressful than you'd like. So something that I would highly recommend. <clears throat> Someone said it's 1.29 a.m. Uh, where they are, but I don't know how that happens because it's 6.24 here. So maybe they're five minutes in the future. Maybe, who knows. Um, so yeah, thank you for coming and watching. I'm gonna be doing another live workout on the 17th of September. I'm gonna try and do at least one a month. So. Um, hit me up on Twitter um, for at, at Tom Daily1994 with any recommendations or anything that you'd like me to do for a workout, whether it's recovery, whether it's stretching, whether it's arms, legs, bum, abs, whatever you like. 
I'll try and do the best workout suited for you guys that you would like. Now I'm really sweaty, need to go and have my protein recovery and also shower because I feel disgusting. But thank you all for coming, I love you. Don't forget to subscribe for more workouts, live workouts, fitness tips, vlogs and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, now I'm gonna shut off the camera, so bye. If I can even shut it off.